for the lay-in, but he's got a depth to his game that will make him a one-and-done talent, saying hand down, man down, sinking the triple. Then Eli King would try to get the Warriors back in the game. They're sinking the baseline jumper. Warriors down four. Then Suggs said he'd had enough. This is what a transcendent talent looks like. Body control reminiscent of a young Derrick Rose. Then check out this dunk. But he wasn't done yet. Check this one out, Pat. His bag of buckets, patent leather. Look oh, at that. Man. Suggs, 42 points. Noah King with 23. Younger brother Eli chipping in 17. But it is not enough in the clash of number ones. Minnehaha Academy wins 92 to 73. Good stuff. NSIC men's basketball from Winona State. The 11 and 9 Warriors hosting the first place 16 and 4 UMD Bulldogs. Early second half, Bulldogs trying to. Play catch up. Drew Blair from beyond the arc for UMD. Warriors with the 49 37 lead. Caleb Wagner can ball. Fills the lane nicely here. Easy finish for the senior 53 39. Wagner not afraid to mix it up down the paint. He'll challenge the big guys just like he does here. Strong finish. It's 55 39 WSU. Then the kickout goes to Alec Rosner. He's not afraid to jack it up. Rosner for three as Winona State picks up a nice victory tonight, 85-63. They'll host St. Cloud State tomorrow night at 5.30. The UMD women are coached by former St. Mary's head coach Mandy Pearson. Bulldogs 15-5, Winona State 14-4. Third quarter, the Dogs extend their lead. Brooke Olson with the strong turnaround. It's 41-33, UMD on top. Olson finished with 20. Warriors looking to make that run go inside to Emma Fee. She's going to score more than that. Every time she gets the ball down low, she had 14, then it's Taylor Husted doing some work with the basketball. Look at the turnaround, Jay, with the defenders, 57-39. Husted doing more damage down low, connecting the little fadeaway. Husted with a team high 19. UMD gets the road win tonight, 72-59 is the final. High school girls, the third-ranked Lord Eagles riding a five-game win streak into tonight's rematch against Stewartville. The Tigers won against Lord earlier at home this month. Good defense by the Eagles out the gate. Anna Otto connects with sophomore C.J. Adamson in transition for the easy lay-in. Next play, though, Stewie comes right back with the answer. Senior Olivia Quam drains the corner three to send the Tigers to the lead. Moments later, Stourville pulls out the exact same sequence, but this time it's freshman Haley Strum with the Bucket there, Stewartville up four, but the Eagles all-time leading scorer tags in to show off her range beyond the arc. Alyssa Usby for three and the lead. The future North Carolina Tar Heel with 35 points as Lord with a big-time win over Stewartville. They win that one 74 to 46. Elsewhere, Allie Hunstead with 27 points for ZM as they beat Triton by two on the road, 82-78. We have one more page coming up. Cass and Manorville. Doubles up Cannon Falls 70 to 35. Now the Mayo Spartans back home after losing a nail biter at Austin Monday night, hosting the 2 and 13 Faribault Falcons. First half, Falcons down 13 with a chance to cut into the deficit. Abdu Abdullahi gets something to go in the paint, but the Spartans led 28 